Picks and Parlay family, it's me, Detroit Lenny here to talk a little MLB action. Uh, we're going to talk to Athletics and the Angels for Thursday, July 25th. And to do that, let's bring in here the man, the myth, the legend himself, Mr. Sean Higgs. Uh, don't forget, guys, like, share, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you're at picksandparlays.net, you're looking for Mr. Sean Higgs' premium plays, best bets. That's where you find them, picksandparlays.net. Use this promo code right here. Save you 20% off your all your purchases at the website. Now, A's minus 105, Angels minus 105. It's a pickup type game. Totals at nine. Who are we, Mr. Sean Higgs? You picked a, a hell of a matchup here. Maybe a Thursday night baseball. I don't know. Well, uh, <laughs> you know, it's there's a cup. There's what a leaf. I think seven or eight games tomorrow. A lot of day action. Uh, I figure I'd give you one. It's a night game. It, it's one of the two night games. It's an ugly one for sure, right? I mean, look at the A's, look at the Angels, two teams not expecting much, probably involved in a trade deadline, deals, Angels getting away people. I'm going to look at the over here. I mean, we got a Ross Stripling sighting who hasn't pitched since uh, May 24th, and he was rocking out a giant. Forget it. I mean, I'm not going to dump into his numbers because it was so long. I mean, his area was 582. To, to make it seem where he was. Um, but shockingly, though, uh, in those 11 games, only three he gave up more than f- uh, three runs there. He gave up uh, six runs twice in an 11th spot. So he wasn't terrible. But I'm going to look at the over here based on we got some not very good teams here, number one. Uh, so Stripling could give up some runs here to the Angels, who are rolling out a guy in Rosenberg. Again, stretched out. Two starts. Two long relief repeaters, one against the A's where he actually went uh, four innings giving up a run just last week on the 20th. But the A's, as we know, have been raking of late, right? We saw them go into Philly, put up a bunch of runs. Now, today's game, I don't even know if it's like 2-1 or 2-2. It's early here on a Wednesday with them in day action. Uh, eight runs, four runs, five runs, eight runs, 13 runs, 18 runs, five and six runs their last eight games. So they're hitting the ball. I'm getting a guy they're stretching out from a bullpen. He kind of shut them down, but is that more of we didn't really know who you were? We were hitting the ball pretty good, and that was a game where they didn't score double-digit runs. I'm going to go over here. A's are hitting. They're sending the guy out again. Anytime I could fade a guy off of an injury return, you're only going to get a few kind of innings anyway. He hasn't pitched well. Forget this season in quite a while. I mean, he's a nice journeyman kind of guy, I guess, Mm -hmm. for back-end inning eater. But you're going to give me a nine, I'm going to go over because, you know, we're going to get some runs early. I think this game will probably be like at six by the fourth or fifth thing. I think we should I was see five or six say, I might even look at the first five over. Yeah. Uh, you know. Team totals I, to look at. Yeah. You know, stuff like that. Any which way, shape, or form you want to get on something like and, that is the way to go. You know, not for nothing here. I got the Angels. I was doing midday my day. I took a couple. I took Angels as a dog against yeah. Castillo. It's just a huge number. And not that the yeah. Angels are great. But I grabbed some of the Ruby props. Hey, Right, you're going to go from facing Seattle with that pitching staff, one of the best in the league, to to Ross Stripling, who, <laughs> right, yeah, no, yeah, and, right, exactly. So, boom, add in a fact, we're coming back in off a road trip. Granted, Seattle, LA is not terrible, but you come home, it's still a bad spot for the home team, and it's not a good home team. More runs right. for Oakland. What I like about this is you mentioned both teams will probably be sellers at the trade deadline, stuff like that. You don't think these guys know that, these players, especially Oakland, arguably the worst team in the league. Chicago will give them some run for their money, whatever. But, I mean, ultimately, these guys are auditioning to get on, you know, they want to be snagged to a competitive type team. That's how I kind of look at this type of year, too. And, and what have you seen now, these two guys in the last two weeks? They're 7-3. and three. Coming yeah. into Wednesday action. I know this and is for Thursday, just, but coming into Wednesday, they're on seven to three runs. They call they're like, hey, mm-hmm. it's uh if we get traded, so be it. Let's just have fun and hit, right. hit our stats or whatever they're doing. They're 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 generating runs and wins and stuff like that. So I like that over nine athletics and the angels Thursday night. Small slate, but I like the Thursday night baseball action uh from Mr. Sean Higgs. Don't forget, go over to picksandparlays.net. Use that promo code. Save you some money. That man right there will make you some Number money. Two. Number two in the money. It's that simple, folks. Over nine angels and the athletics. Thanks for watching. Good luck unless you're against us. Take care, folks.